games and day tonight where no regrets will be shown. You're looking live at the Red Hot Physics Space game known as Rocket League and already early on in this matchup. Look at Nat scoring right there there. Take a look at the replay. This is basketball, ladies and gentlemen. Up midair. There you see Nat though. The early going to this matchup. There's the ball going right into the net of Epic Killer, meaning that Nat represented the blue team going against the orange team. Did score early on to this matchup with just four minutes and 58 seconds and counting. Nevertheless, though, this is Rocket League as mentioned. Thanks for joining us live for the tape in front of Mike Brand and a night where Rebel Tea Time will be here to announce his two members that will be fighting along alongside him as Epic Killer is trying to fight back right now, trying to redeem himself. And again, ladies and gentlemen, later on tonight, Rebel Tea Time will be here when they take on Minigun Killer 10, Xbox Free Pit, and Scorch representative of the Gaming Weekly. Hello again, everybody. I'm Adrian the Voice at GameSide, and later on tonight, T will be here. It's mentioned to announce the two other members who will be aiding him, the Rebel Weekly, that is. The Rebel Weekly, they want us to shut down. That is a developing story as we see Epic Killer up midair. There you see the ball right now loose. And Epic Killer isn't going to hold back right now. Trying to go to the blue team space. Trying to score right there there. Well, you know, Rebel T-Time did change. And not for the better, it all started on that Roblox night when T and the other Rebel Weekly members stated that they wanted us to shut down. They don't like us. More on that story later on. But on Rocket League tonight, a plethora of different cars showing their explosive power and speed. Epic Killer right now is frozen in time. Back into the action as well against his opponent. What an impressive matchup, though, guys. Four minutes and counting at this point in time. Very distinct styles of gameplay. Both teams showing their <coughs> offense and defense here tonight. You know the blue and orange team, they're going to have to do all they can to try to win this matchup. That is Burial Nat and Epic Killer. Epic Killer up midair, though. Saw the early one of this matchup, though. Nat did have the momentum on his side because he scored earlier on. What a great way to start the broadcast. A unique match tonight on the Hoops AK Basketball. These players have to score as many times as possible before the time runs out. As you see on top of your screen, which is three minutes and 34 seconds and counting. Back into the action right now. The ball is up midair. It looks like Epic Killer now dictated the pace of this matchup. You know you want to dictate the pace of this matchup to try to win here tonight. Nonetheless, you know, one has to imagine whether or not pressure is building it up inside for, well, Epic Killer because we saw in the early going of this broadcast how the blue team, how Nat was able to score right there to there. But the question is, is pressure really good for Epic Killer? Does it motivate him to do well or is it really trying to, well, mess him up, so to speak? Could be a double-edged sword here tonight. We're still waiting for the arrival of T, who's going to be arriving later on tonight. Open. Oh, no. What a close score right there. You saw Nat was waiting for that ball to go inside the net, but no. But as mentioned, Tea Time is going to be announcing his teammates to go against the great channel known as the Gaming Weekly. The Gaming Weekly, an amazing channel. It cannot fall into the hands of Rebel Weekly. The Rebel Weekly, those Rebels, stated that they don't like our content. They don't like the managers. They keep taking shot, shots at the channel every single week. And if you ask me, it is absolutely reprehensible. They have no subscribers, no views, no videos at all. I have no idea why they're coming at us to challenge us. The Gaming Weekly has been growing and growing and growing at a rapid, rapid pace. We just don't know why the Rebel Weekly is challenging us, but nevertheless, here tonight into this matchup, Epic Killer though, again, trying to dictate the pace, but no, Nat coming in out of nowhere, trying to dictate the pace of this ball right now. Epic Killer on the other side. Nat right now, the challenger there, you see up, oh, they're trying to dictate this ball right now, folks. Into this matchup, the basketball, there you see Nat with one point though, with just two minutes and seven seconds and counting. The question is, can somehow, someway, Epic Killer actually turn the tables right now? Epic Killer trying to go against the ball, misses wildly though. Nat has control into this matchup. But there you see Epic Killer, though, with a Duke and Dodge. Again, speed and agility. This is the main factor. The two main factor points into this matchup. Speed and agility as Nat right now pushing the ball towards the net. Is he going to score again? No. Going to the other side right in the middle of the map right there. So you see Epic Killer almost scoring, but no as well. Epic Killer is going really fast here. You see the Duke and Dodge and the boost he's using exactly. The speed and agility to this matchup. That's exactly what Epic Killer needs to do. There he comes Nat, but couldn't quite do so into this matchup. Epic Killer may very well score. He does. Epic Killer scored. It is one on one right now. Epic Killer with one point as opposed to the blue team. That is Nat, who has a point. Congratulations to Epic Killer. Take a look at the replay. A nice combo there. Epic Killer is no joke tonight. You best believe Nat is not a joke as well. You best believe that Nat is going to try to redeem himself. Wait a minute, Epic Killer. Oh my. More like what we saw in the beginning of the broadcast. How Nat, at the beginning of the round, scored. Take a look at the replay. Epic Killer now turn to the tables on Nat. A minute and 26 seconds and counting at this point in time. You know, Epic Killer with two points. But again, we're still waiting. We're still talking about Rebel Weekly. The Rebel Weekly challenging the Gaming Weekly. They said that they don't like our content. They don't like our videos. They don't like the managers taking shots at us every single week. I don't understand why the Rebel Weekly really, I just don't understand why they don't like us. 
But nonetheless, as you see Nat, though, and Epic Killer continue this assault right now. The ball going to the other side. Nat and Epic Killer, they have their eyes glued right into the ball. Here comes Epic Killer, but no! Oh, the ball going to the other side. Who's going to reach it first? One minute remaining into this matchup. Momentum shifts is another factor point of this matchup as well. Epic Killer up midair as you see Nat trying to dictate the pace of this matchup as well. We saw Nat though the early one of this matchup. The momentum was on his side before Epic Killer was able to score twice. Now the momentum is on his side. His being Epic Killer's side. Uh oh, wait a minute. The ball's about to score. No, go to the other side. Nat right now. Duking and dodging. Using the boost right now. I still can't believe though that two members are going to be joining the Rebel Weekly. I mean, let's not forget, Minigun announced this past week that his two members are Xbox Freak Pete and, well, it's Scorch the executive of the Gaming Weekly. Remember, Scorch and Minigun, they weren't on the same page prior to the Rebel Weekly, but it looks like they take the, uh, they're take they taking the Rebel Weekly's threat as a priority, so they have to work together. And Xbox Freak Pete joining last week, 10 seconds remaining, folks. I believe it's safe to say that I believe, yes, I think Epic Killer is going to win this matchup, though. Can somehow, some way, can Nat score, but no, Epic Killer was able to push the ball away, away from the Met. It looks like Epic Killer wins this matchup, I believe. Yes, he does. Epic Killer winning here tonight. Congratulations to Epic Killer, who won this matchup, defeated Nat. But Nat has nothing to be ashamed of. A few hits here and there, and Nat could have been the winner of this matchup. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we were talking about this all night. Rebel Weekly is here. Rebel Tea time is here, folks. Please welcome T. Welcome T. Ladies and, ladies and gentlemen. I am Tea Time, and I'm here to announce the two people that is joining, that will be joining this war. They are here tonight, and they will announce, they will present themselves right here, oh. right now. Wait a minute. <coughs> Epic Wait a Killer minute. just joined the Epic party in Aqua Titan. Titan. We just saw Epic party Killer play in the game. <coughs> Adrian, look. I'm not wasting... I am part of the rebel. Oh, so you think this is nice? So you actually think it was great for you to actually play a part of the game? That's weekly? right. That's right. It's officially time. We are shutting you guys down. We are winning. Oh, that's nice too. Beat us. So now you. If you can so beat us. No, beat us. If you can survive, if we let you. I have no idea. I have. I have no idea, folks. And Adrian, World War Three starts now. We're starting World War Three officially here on YouTube.